All right, so this guy right here wanted to do a lemon challenge. A lemon challenge. We wanted to see who can squeeze the most lemon into the mouth without seeing anything or spinning it out. If it's too sour, game over. You spit it on the plate. Put it on the plate. So he wanted to do a half a lemon, and I talked him into doing a quarter of a lemon. So, again, just a little tip for some parents out there. I know we seem to spend a lot of time with our kids um, because it's usually just us. But um, make it fun, make it interesting, make it silly, make it count. That's it. That's that's the only thing I need to say. So, with that being said, are you ready? Yes. Here's our I'm not lemon. ready. Here is our lemon. So, are we squeezing it? Are we sucking it? Are we biting it? We're squeezing and sucking. Ooh. Oh, you lose already. No. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. We're, all right. we're, we're doing, doing this and sucking it. Okay, so... On your march. And do this. Get set. That's a choice. Go. Go. Ah! So I would say <laughs> he won. That was sour. <laughs> that was sour. Now with the rest of the lemons that we bought. From Valley yeah. for a dollar ninety nine. It came for five lemons and a huge head cabbage <laughs> for a dollar ninety nine. So, yes, it's a shameless plug. Go to Valley if your funds are low. If you got twenty dollars to last for the week, you can get you some my favorite red sticker meat and hit up the clearance rack. For the veggies for a dollar ninety nine. It's generally where I shop um, for everything, um, and it's an international market too. So I'm not missing out on buying some of the things that I used to get in uh, the city of Philadelphia. So peace. With a lemon on top. 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 With a lemon. <laughs> See you soon, guys. See you soon.